the support to local K through 12 continues to lay lag behind because that investment has not been made. Today, that is in the Senate's budget. Additionally, we have a key refundable earned income tax credit that hits the most critical components to the families that have income, but not enough. It makes it fully refundable in Virginia. This is another key difference between the Senate budget and the House budget. Furthermore, we have dedicated $200 million to our at-risk schools. The House budget has zero. These are dollars that are critical. You hear a lot of rhetoric and talk on the other side about key investments. The Senate Democratic budget has put that in its budget, $200 million. The House has nothing right now.